Good morning, parents. I know some of um, some of you guys reached out to the teachers, um, sort of uh, asking that you're unable to access iReady. Well, this is a brief um, tutorial on how to access iReady from your uh, laptop and or uh, your smart devices, including tablets or phones or anything of that nature. So before we get started with the tutorial, I would like to explain that iReady will only work with Google Chrome. Again, iReady will only work with Google Chrome. So um, let's get started. At this time, if you are working with an iPad or some sort of um, smart tablet or um, a computer, um, I would advise you to go to your internet browser I will go to mine, which is Safari, and you will log into google.com. Once you are in google.com in the search engine, I want you to type in download Google Chrome and press enter. Once this comes, you'll be directed to this page. And usually it gives you the options. Um, they'll tell you to download Google Chrome. You'll click on this. And um, since I'm using a Mac, it gave me the option of download Google Chrome for Mac. However, if you're not using Mac, or um, it, you'll get redirected to your um, specific devices. So if it says, um, download um, you'll be directed to download Chrome for um, a PC or you'll get redirected to download Chrome for a tablet or an iPad um, whichever device you're using you should be able to download Google Chrome just follow the steps once you click on the, the what once you click on the button it says download Google Chrome for Mac since I already have it downloaded um, I will not do it again but in your case I will I need you guys to click on that and after that just follow the regular instruction the way they're um, doing it and sometimes at the end they'll tell you to re restart the device so follow that instruction to get an access of Google Chrome so since we are done with Google Chrome and you will be, once you restart or once you get a full access of Google Chrome, you will then go to the website, www.i-ready.com. So you'll be redirect, redirected to this page and it says username, password. Um, your teachers emailed you all the login information for your child, which is a username and the password. Um, if you have not received it, please check the junk mail because sometimes mails get lost in there. And if you still cannot find the login information, please contact your child's teacher and we will provide you with the username and the password. Right now, I will be accessing one of my students' um, iReady to show you what it looks like once you are in the system. Once you um, put in your username and password, please make sure it says New York when it comes to state. Um, it has to say New York. So please make sure to um, put that and press on go. Choose a subject. You will be redirected to your child's page. Over here it reading. says reading and over math. here it says math. So um, BCS has directed you to do iReady for 30 minutes for ELA, 30 minutes for math. So I will be choosing reading, reading. first. You click on reading and it tells you um, the next lesson. At this point, our students already know how to um, take care of or navigate iReady because we have done it every week um, since the school year started. 
So once you're done with 30 minutes of reading, you can take a quick 10 minute break or five minutes break, or you can do some stretching with your um, children, anything that will help them to get refocused. Once you're done, you just go up here math. and you switch it to math. Same thing. This is the page usually it comes and you are ready to do the next Resume lesson. lesson. And once the lesson is done, you to will do. log out. Log out. And that's it. If you have any further questions, please do reach out to your child's teacher. Thank you and enjoy the rest of your day.